here's my version of Buckets of Rain. Now, I have an old video on this. I'm sort of updating it because um, the other one's not very good quality and I leave out a couple things. So this is a Bob Dylan song. I'm going to play it for you and then I'll show you the different parts. It's in drop D tuning. Okay, so the low string is down to a D. Everything else is normal. E, B, G, D, A, low E, low D. basic arrangement okay so if you don't know the song go listen to it um, it's a good it's a good tune this is not the way Dylan plays it he plays it in open D tuning but let me show you the various licks so here's lick number one so what's going on well with the left hand I'm sliding from the fifth fret on the B string to the seventh fret and then I'm catching the high E string on the fifth fret. So it's and when I'm doing that, you get over here. Here's how they work together. So it's a pinch. to a regular D chord and you hammer on the first string second fret and then you get the third fret on the second string sorry and then again you're doing that with the bass this string down so you've got to go to the fifth fret on the bass note low E and I'm playing open B string with that and then to the third fret again here's how those two work together string and back to the opening.
other lick that I do on G is this. I'll play the G. And now I'm going to bring my thumb all the way down to this G note. Down. So the walk down is a little different, not hard, just different. So I'm on fifth string, fifth fret, first string, sixth fret, third string. And then down two frets. So third fret on the first, fourth fret on the third. And then both on the second, both open, and back to D. And in terms of what am I doing over here? I'm playing the third string, then the first. Slide it down. Open. And during that, my thumb is, instead of playing the D to the D, I'm playing the A string to the D string. I'm going. a little sort of, I would call it his guitar solo. So he's playing along and he goes like this. Sorry. So what is that? That's the same figure where I'm playing the first and third string. These are called sixths because they are six notes apart on a scale. So this is the eighth fret. This is the ninth fret. And I slide that. From there, up two frets to 10th and 11th. Picking wise, it's like this. So I play real slow, pinch, first string, thumb on the high D, and then I play it all together. Low D plus the first and third string when I get up to 10 and 11. back down to the okay, okay. there's all the uh, nitty-gritty hope that helped see you around